Good morning, good morning. I told you the news is big. Hi, I'm Paul Begley. Have you ever traveled anywhere in the world? If you've ever traveled anywhere in the world, you know that the world is different everywhere. Different views, different cultures, different religions, different economic statuses, different climates. I've been in nine countries of the world, but uh, never to Taiwan. But I will say this. I've been to India though and I can tell you it's similar and that's when torrential when 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 tremendous rains and monsoon rains or very heavy rains it can create mudslides rock slides and danger well typhoon typhoon migi hit taiwan after already ripping through the philippines and killing 26 people typhoon migi hit taiwan last night and 27 people are missing. Another 340 are trapped. We're not sure about their condition. And three people died. Now, if you was to think of the country of Taiwan, where would probably, you know, of all the places you want to be, the safest place you'd probably want to be would be in the house of God. Well, three people died in Taiwan last night sitting in a Buddhist temple called the White Cloud Temple. There they perished. They died. It had been safer anywhere else but the Buddhist temple. Reflect on that a moment. Let me read to you quickly. I've got to hurry, okay? So let me read to you quickly. Record rains from a powerful typhoon, Migi, caused massive muds and rock slides in Taiwan. It buried a Buddhist temple and trapped vehicles on the highway where one bus carrying 19 Chinese tourists have come up missing. They're part of the 27 that are missing. The mudslide at the temple killed three people. And overall, there's over 27 people still missing in Taiwan as Typhoon Migi swept through, swept, swept through the country of Taiwan after killing 26 people in the Philippines and now is headed toward China. Migi dumped a record 45 inches of rain in 48 hours. People, that's at biblical proportions. That's at about the pace of Noah's flood. Uh, also, Typhoon Migi had 90 mile hour winds, 245 miles southeast of Hong Kong. It is headed in that direction. Now, three people did die in Taiwan. Where? At the White Cloud Temple in Sao City, Taiwan. The, the building was completely buried in a mudslide. Now, let me read to you what it says in uh, the Bible here in um, Matthew 24. They, the disciples were on the Mount of Olives. They came to Jesus and said, Master, they said, Jesus, tell us, when shall these things be? What are the sign of thy coming and the end of the world? Jesus answered and said this, Take heed that no man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ, and shall deceive many. Or I am God, or I am your supreme leader, or I am your safety. Sort of like Buddha did when he Profess that he had all wisdom and all power and they then create these idol gods these little Buddhas sitting around and you can see them in Chinese restaurants or you can see them in uh, different establishments gift shops don't buy those and take those home and stick those on your shelf don't put another God the Bible tells you thou shalt have no other gods before me do not do this and during a typhoon don't run to a Buddhist temple it may be suicide now let me read on. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ, and shall deceive many. And you shall hear of wars and rumors of wars, but see that you be not troubled. For all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. For nation shall rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom. There shall be famines, pestilence, or diseases. There shall be earthquakes, or natural disasters, in divers or different places, including typhoons. All these are the beginning of sorrow now if you're watching right now and you're, you're saying Paul I, I don't I take offense to the fact that you're saying those people died because they were in the Buddhist temple somehow that's why they died I'm saying if they weren't in the Buddhist temple they're not dead today I'm saying that that's just one incident and now there's been people who've died in Christian churches I mean so you can easily say, well, what's that got to do with it? I'm just trying to tell you. Don't put your faith in man or a man-made religion. You need to focus on the creator. Buddha was not the creator. 
The Dalai Lama is not your salvation. Jesus of Siberia is an idiot. Reverend Jim Jones was an absolute heretic. Listen, Idi Amin was a murderer in Uganda. There's been false prophets, Adolf Hitler, false Christ, false Antichrist spirits, murderous spirits of, of the Jews and Christians, and now radical Islam is truly in spreading the world. Don't forget about the earthquake also that happened in Baja, California. 6.9 on the Richter scale. That's just, oh, by the way, it's fulfillment of Bible prophecy in the book of Matthew 24 and in the book of Revelation. I'm Paul Bagley. Stay out of Buddhist temples.